I'm Dirk Daner, president and co-founder of the Tama Finland Foundation. I'm Sharp, I am the vice president and the curator here. The Tama Finland Foundation was first created because Tom wanted an archive, but very soon after that, friends of ours who were artists were asking whether we would accept some of their work. We did, and then the AIDS epidemic happened, and a lot of art was needing a place, a new home. And the crisis was a lot of people wouldn't accept this. And so uh, our uh, permanent collection just grew. The foundation has evolved over the years in that what we've done is added more programs to it. We have done uh, the Art and Culture Festival for quite some many years. Right here and in New York. We've had the Emerging Artists Competition going on for also quite a few years. People that haven't maybe have no audience, they can submit their work here, maybe people haven't seen it before, and they can share their fantasies and other people can get off on their fantasy. One aspect of that is that we have a very active residency program here at the Tom House in that we have two artists at one time and they come from different parts of the world oftentimes. They spend three months here and create work. Everything you see here um, in the foundation has been a gift either from the artist or from a collector. There's great value on them. There's artistic value, there's historical value. Tom and I dreamt, you know, daydreamed, uh, uh, fantasized about one day having all of our friends and all of our the artists that we have in our collection. But we thought about having an exhibition that would be out in the world. And many of the artists, they contributed thinking that just maybe they would not be forgotten by, uh, by being connected to the Tama Finland Foundation. Artists got to come here and experience other artists. There's all the stories that they were telling each other that are remembered. So we're able to take the, not only the artworks, but the stories with us. And I think that working with the community and their visit here, they were so impressed by the telling and the tales. That's what this exhibition they wanted. That's what this exhibition has become, is about the stories. And how we are all together in that uh, artists really thrive when they get to interact with each other.